guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have an unboxing which is going to be a start of another video that I'm going to do, a hair video of course. So this is the packaging that it came in. I ordered this from Love Me Virgin Hair. Um, I think I ordered it on the 21st. Shipping was very fast coming from China. China. Uh, I got it on the 23rd I think by the end of the day. Now this is the package, like I said, came in this, the DHL packaging. And you are able to ship your, not ship, track your, um, your package. This is the box that it came in. Look at this, guys. This is so cute. Purple is one of my favorite colors. I think I'm going to keep this box maybe forever in a day. So I was just searching online. I'm going through a weird awkward stage right now because I want to grow my hair back. And I haven't shaved my, I haven't shaved my sides in a minute. So... I said, let me see what I can do to, I guess, keep my styles trendy and don't look like a boo boo the food. So, I ordered this hair, like I said, from Love Me. I'm going to give you the specs of the Love Me virgin hair. I ordered the affordable full lace wig for making bo box braids. And that's what I wanted to do. I wanted some box braids, but I didn't want to put it in my own hair, being that I'm trying to get it back in this healthy state and grow it back. So this wig initially cost um, $116.90. I found a coupon code. I think it was like 20 something percent off. And I ended up saving like $26. So I paid like $90.62. Now this says it's, I'm trying to give you some specs of the hair itself. If I can find it. Uh, it says shipping worldwide express delivery to, to four business days. Uh, they do accept returns. They have free gifts inside the package, so I'll let you know exactly what those are. And it said lightly bleach knots. So we use lightly bleach to make the wig natural because excessive bleaching will damage the hair roots. I'm glad for that. The knots are, like, like I said, pre-bleached. The length is 8 inches in full lace wig, 20 inches braid hair. Uh, the weight is 200 grams. Wig, the wig hair is 100% virgin hair from one, it says donor, and then hair retarded fiber, lasts for more than a year, there's 150% density, the wig color is natural black, um, they do have two colors, which is black and um, number four, my phone has died, but let's get into the specs of the hair, like I said, it came in <laughs> this package, and this is the invoice that it came with. It just gives you where it came from. Um, your address, commercial invoice. It tells you the volume of the hair. And then you track the invoice number. Okay, like I said, I ordered it on the 21st and got it the 23rd. You cannot beat that. And it's great packaging. So let's get in. I have already opened it because, like I said, this is my first ever lace front wig. First ever. First ever. So... Number one, I have to get comfortable with even wearing a full, full lace front wig or just a, I wouldn't even say a full wig because I've wore a full wig before, but it's always been like natural curly hair and you really couldn't tell that it was. So let's get to what's in the box. So when I open it, it says, enjoy your hair journey from now on. Halita, the founder of Love Me Hair. It comes like that. So inside of the box, initially, like I said, it comes with two bundles of braiding hair. And these are the two bundles. They're extremely long, yes. Very long. All right. If I can, this is how long. You can see how long these are. I'm not quite sure where I'm gonna. This hair kind of. This is my first time smelling. Kind of smells like. I don't say chemicals or whatever, but I may try to just braid one. One of these, I guess, to see what how it works. I did order some braiding hair. Like I said, I want to do box braids. So that's good. They gave me two bundles. Inside again, this is the wig. And then inside they have I Love Me Hair. They have the, the return policy and how to care for the hair all inside. Very neat. Everything that you may need in order to take care of the wig. It tells you if you're unit shedding, what to do. And other frequently asked questions about the product. That's a plus. It also comes with a wig cap, and this is the, I guess like the neutral color, superior, um, superior quality. There are two pieces in here, and it says one size fits all. Then stocking fiber, fiber for wig wears, polyester, 
material. So it's two of these in here, which is great as well. And it also comes with this little cute makeup bag, whatever you want to put your, you know, your lipstick or eyeshadow and all that stuff in here. Um, it comes with a rectal comb and elastic band, which is a plus because I'm really going to use this and put this on my wig to make sure that it lays properly. I also have uh, the Love Me Hair. This is the hair wax stick. It's to make your hair flawless. I'm assuming this is for like um, edge, edge tamer or ed your edges. I'm not sure. It comes with these two pink clips. Two pink clips and some bobby pins.
brush so make sure all your hair is, is brushed in because you don't want to get whatever you're tinting your knots or or bleaching or however you want to call it spray tanning your knots but you don't want to get it on the hair so I'm going to make sure all of it is brushed in and again I hope I have enough of it to use so for for now I'm going to just focus on the front of the head because um, that's mainly what is going to really make a difference because I want that part to really look as natural as possible so sure, this is all tucked in like, it's, like I said I am not a professional with this you guys at, at all so this is going to be a trial and error on camera with you guys, I'm not ashamed to to do it or show it on camera because it's gonna get done eventually. Like it, I'm gonna try to do it. I'm just making sure all my hair is tucked in and there. And I don't have any T pins. I went to Silas Beauty yesterday. They didn't have them. Like what? You would think they would have the T pins, but so I thought in my head too. I have. I sew things, so I have like straight pins and all of that stuff. So when I get to really doing something to this wig, I will, uh, I would probably just use my stick pins. So, let's put this under my cap just to get a little hole on it. I can pull the cap up. Alright, I'm pretty much finished, you guys. But I'm going to just go back and see what it is like plotted and make sure that everything is in and it's on this freaking hairline so, just make sure that is up there because I, I want this hairstyle to be perfect almost let's say because it is my first time with the lace front and I'm going out of town for Labor Day, so I'm hoping that it turns out great. And I just want to make sure I get those knots in the front as well. If it gets on my wig cap, so be it. But this is where I start to press a little harder right here around the hairline area. Just to make sure that it's flawless. This is where you can see if you missed some spots. Like right here. I missed right here. Yes. Let's get some more of the concealer. And I'm going to leave the light on for a little bit so I can see what areas I missed or I need to hit. And I can see it very well, you know, with the ring light on and I'm filming so and I'm gonna go through and spread that through spread it I'm not and I'm not it might look like I'm pressing hard but I'm not really pressing hard because I don't want it to see I'm just I just got a little firmness to it so let's keep going there's a little spot there this is this is how you can see at the end if you miss some spots i mean get into the light so i'm gonna continue to do this go back around and see where i missed some spots and then fill those in come back show you when i'm how i'm gonna blow dry it and then show you the end results all right you guys it's still a little blotchy but that's okay i'm just going through and uh
the got to be glue type of person. So I just got some stuff that was around the house. This old Aquanet right here. And then this hairspray right here. I think I got this from the dollar store a long time ago. What I used it for, I don't remember. But just to see what it looks like for a second and then I'm actually gonna turn it back over and let it continue to air dry because I'm not gonna do anything to it right now All right. let's, take this let's flip her over Like I said, when I do the middle part, it's, I'm going to have to pluck it. But this is what the hairline is looking like. Can you see? So I just hope it looks... Alright you guys, I still have the lace on it right here. I don't want to cut it off yet. I'm going to just go through and show you some of the parts and what it looks like. Like with the foundation on it. And I have my... Spray water here just to help the hair lay a little bit so you can see. Uh, let's go in the middle. the middle this is what the it's looking like after I put the foundation on right there and let me show you the front I'm sure we're probably gonna have to go through and fix it but for right now just for these purposes I just really wanted to show you guys the the actual Scalp after I well the lace after I um I know I look crazy with this lace on but again I don't want to cut it yet because I have to figure out how I'm gonna I'm gonna do this uh not how because I'm gonna do it I just it's, it's just, this is just water. And there was a little bit of conditioner here left over, so I just added water in it. But 
I just wanted to show you the hairline. I'm sure I'm going to have to go in and pluck some. Just so it'll be more natural. But again, this is the... This is the way the scalp is looking. Look at that. And I didn't have to spend any money. I already had it here at home. I think that cost maybe like four dollars. I got it. I was out of town at the time, and I think I paid like four or five. Might have been like six dollars. It was in the CVS. It was late, and CVS was the only thing that was open. So, but this is like this is what it looks like. Um, I'm not a baby hair person, but it does have baby hairs. But we'll figure that out when that time comes. So. Until my next video, you guys, this is what it's looking like. This is not a, this is not a fit. This is not a, not a look yet, but it's on its way of being a look because it's, I'm going to try something different. Till next time, you guys. Likes 132.